And it's Josh is Josh is feeling a little bit scared of this ridge here. It's it's pretty hairy. I gotta give it to him. You can do it, my boy. Daddy believes in you, my boy. Okay, right, here's the deal. We're here at Sandy Bay. Well, Sandy Bay Nature Reserve, not at the actual bay. If you're a Cape Townian and you hear Sandy Bay, all sorts of crazy things go through your mind. <laughs> we are going to Boss 400, which is a wreck just off the coast here. I'm kind of excited about this. We've been planning this for a couple of weeks now. The hike down there is about an hour and a bit. And I'm not really sure what to expect, so let's start this journey, guys. <laughs> Gentlemen, sunrise over Sandy Bay. Oh. Everyone remember Brad? <laughs> Tranquility cracks. Brad, yeah. new face to the vlog. No one remembers Josh. No. Just hold on, okay, my boy? Just kidding. <laughs> Tom over there. Tom's a new face to the vlog. Oh. Hunting and habitat loss reduce the endangered Malpas to fewer than 2,000. Josh, you're right. Oh. I think we found a path. The paths are difficult to see because of the fire that came through here a couple months ago. Okay, follow me this way. Okay. <laughs> Sweet. Everyone, can we please get a round of applause for Josh? Yeah. Thank you. You really love me. Folks, we have arrived here at Boss 400. What a spectacular sight. Anyway. I think we're gonna have to swim this. The weather looks good, it's a bit windy. Let's go explore this thing. A few inches later. Woo! I am officially on the Boss 400 and you know the ironic thing is I thought it would be quite easy to swim from that rock over there to that landing point over there but it was tough I had, I had this in one hand above my head let's go explore this place inside the belly of the beast. So this is a barge, it's not a ship, so there's no engine room. It ran aground when the tow, when the tow hook broke in 1994. I don't, I don't even want to know what's down there.
making headway slowly but surely up this place finding the right way to do it that you don't fall down you know i can't help but feel like we've taken the hard way up there's got to be an easier way up here so just imagine this crane in its heyday could lift 1200 tons when it was wrecked it was worth about 70 million dollars and they tried to salvage it but nothing was left what's that hold on one second Go. There's a video that was done last week by Chris Rogers uh, where they were actually swinging from this crane on a rope swing. It's an awesome video, all done by professionals, etc, etc. It's a really fun video. You'll see his details below. Go to his YouTube page, subscribe to him. He's a great, great video maker and he's a GoPro ambassador, So, which is what I'm shooting this on right now. So it all seems to fit. Well, Boss 400, thanks for the awesome experience, guys. I do this kind of thing so maybe you don't have to. I don't recommend doing this. This is quite dangerous. If you're not going with somebody who really knows what they're doing, it's probably not best to do it at all. Otherwise, I have quite a bit of fun. It's what it is. It's a rusty old wreck. But it's got a history and it's part of Cape Town. So, I like it. something in my pocket that's hurting me boss 400 is pretty impressive and if you like this vlog please uh share it like my page i'd appreciate it and uh come check out this wreck it's pretty fun